If a tree falls in the forest and no one is there, does it still make a sound? And for that matter, if a cow is allegedly mocked in a poster but is unable to comprehend the English language, is the cow still offended? I ponder the cow query because I think we might have witnessed a jump the sharknado moment when it comes to the animal rights movement and political correctness. Here's the skinny. A billboard campaign was recently advertising the merits of Toronto's Billy Bishop Airport. The copy read, your precious cargo, not cattle. Well, that's nice, but according to the Toronto Star, this slogan triggered Len Goldberg. Len Goldberg is an activist. Funny how activists always seem to get triggered, eh? Especially by trivial things, and activists always seem to have all kinds of time on their hands. It must be nice being an activist. Anyway, activist Goldberg posted a Facebook message noting how the billboard was insulting to cows. Uh, think about that for a second, folks. He thinks there might be a cow out there that can somehow comprehend English and then, well, <laughs> have a cow? How dare the word cattle is used as a pejorative term? That might just be the new C word. Here's what happened. Goldberg was able to rally numerous like-minded assorted nuts to complain to Ports Toronto, the government entity that operates the airport. That's when the people running Ports Toronto had a hearty laugh and told Goldberg and company to jump in nearby Lake Ontario. Uh, no, that's not what happened. Because this is 2017, Ports Toronto immediately removed the poster. Oh yes, and they issued a groveling apology too. Spokeswoman Deborah Wilson said that on sober second thought, the ad copy had indeed implied disrespect for animals, something that the airport never intended. Said Wilson, quote, perspective and discourse is an interesting and important element of any public campaign. We appreciate that these concerns were brought forward so that we could better understand the issue and respond quickly to remedy the situation. End quote. <laughs> the situation? I, I thought situations at airports typically involve hijackings and hostages, not cows that in theory might be offended by ad copy, assuming cows have such cerebral wherewithal to begin with. Then again, perhaps this newfound sensitivity regarding the feelings of the bovine community is a good idea. I mean, after all, just in case cows can indeed read, Think of how insulting it would be for old Bessie to gaze upon an insulting billboard making light of cattle. I mean, <laughs> that might just completely ruin her trip to the slaughterhouse. For the Rebel Dot Media, I'm David the Menzoid Menzies. Like what you just saw? Then click subscribe below and never miss another Rebel video.